Bill, a couple of years ago, uh, people are saying, well, Colorado just doesn't have Pac-12 caliber athletes to win in this conference. Now with a very similar core, yeah. you're winning. Did you become Pac-12 level athletes or did something else change? I mean, we've been Pac-12 level athletes. It was the fact that we were young. You know, Coach Matt came in and he brought a lot of us in and we were young, you know, and it's hard to win games when you're inexperienced, you're 19, 17, 18 years old, and you're going against 21, 22 year olds. Um, you know, and it's an elite level. Uh, we've got, you know, we've caught, caught up with everybody and we're, you know, we're older, we're bigger, stronger, and we're more mature. Phil, can you talk about Kyle Evans? Yeah. And, you know, obviously a little guy, but uh, runs with a lot of power yeah. and uh, he's done a lot of great things to earn a scholarship and now mm -hmm. he's earning a lot of key playing time. Can you just talk about what he's done. Kyle, you know, Kyle's came in and, and he, he's done his role. And, you know, and everybody's role changes, you know, from him not, you know, coming in just as a, a walk-on. Kyle has always, you know, went hard and uh, never complained, never complained about not having a scholarship. Uh, actually, Kyle has, you know, been by my side through a lot of things, you know, along with Cheeto and a couple of my teammates. But Kyle has been, you know, as a running back, he's always been by my side. And Kyle just, you know, he's just, He's coming in and he's, uh, you know, fitting in right in. So I'm proud of him and, I, and hopefully he continues to uh, help us out and give us that spark. Hey, uh, Philip, you, you've got that quote unquote signature win that you guys are looking for. How important is it to follow it up with a win that, uh, with a with a win in a game that you're supposed to win? You know, Oregon State, you guys are favored. I mean, is that the next step in this program? Is to follow up a good win like that with another one? And I mean, because if you don't, then that, that you know that signature win is maybe. Dampen a little bit. I mean, we don't we don't worry about that. We worry about Colorado. That's it. Uh, everybody, you know, everybody's you know still talking about Oregon. You know, and that's done. You know, we're on to Oregon State, and Oregon State's you know a good team. And if you don't go in there with the right attitude in any Pac-12 team, you're not going to come out you know with the win. So we're just worrying about ourselves, and we're going out there and playing Colorado football. That's it. Philip, as an offensive player, how much comfort does it give you? To now know after Stevens' performance in Oregon that you guys have two quarterbacks that can you know put put together those type of performances. Um, we've known all along that both Steven Montez and Sefo were great quarterbacks. Um, you have to you have to uh, understand Steven you know took the whole spring ball. You know he's been you know been in, in with the spring ball and everything else. You know and you know Sefo he's been here for a long time. Um, I mean it pretty much comes down to everybody around them. If everybody around them is doing their part, it helps them out tremendously. You know, if we're blocking, if we're, if, if we're making the right reads, if we're making the right cuts, if we're running the ball well, if the receivers are getting open, it makes the quarterback's job easy. So for, for Montez to go in there and do what he had to do, you know, it was expected for him to, to come up and, and, and do what he did because that's the caliber player he is. And I'm proud of him and, and um, you know, excited to see, excited to see uh, what he did that game. Philip, what's been the reaction around campus for the last two days about that win? Um, I mean, everybody's excited. Everybody's excited. Um, you know, you got you know some people uh, try to make sure it says don't get to your head. But you know, we're we're a, we're an older team, and we've we've been through a lot. We've been through a lot, and uh, you know, we've been through hard times, and you know, hopefully, we're going we're going to have a lot of great times. So. Um, uh, it, the atmosphere is great, you know, the atmosphere is great, and uh, we just need to continue to uh, come together as a, a student body and as a whole in the University of Colorado. That, that helps. Phil, what does it mean to you when you see your coach getting so emotional after a win like that? Uh, it means a lot. I mean, Coach Max has been a father to a lot of us. He uh, he he gave a lot of us opportunities. Uh, like I said, we came in with him. We're, we're the, the senior class here. Uh, and even though I'm a Richard junior, you know, I came in with the senior class. We're, we're real close with each other when it comes to with the coaches and with each other, period. And uh, for Coach Mac, uh, it's just it's just a lot of he's, – he spent a tirelessly, tireless days trying to get, you know, get through to us and trying to find ways for us to, to understand that, you know, we're a special team and that we're a special group of kids. And, um, you know, to sit, to sit here and be able to see him, be able to – show his emotions and stuff like that. It's a great feeling. He deserves it. And we're going to keep on uh, making him proud and, and uh, doing what, we, what we're here to do, and that's win football games.